Here is another question with numbers and this time we are going to maximize. The question here is find the two numbers whose sum is 32 and whose product is a maximum. So let's define let the numbers be x and y. Correct? So this is find the two numbers whose sum is 32 x plus y equals to 32 and whose product is a maximum. So let p be the product of x and y. We want to maximize the product. So the idea is write in one variable. So from the first equation, what do you get? From the first equation, you can write y as equal to 32 minus x. Now this is very important equation. We'll substitute here and at the end we can find the other number using this equation. Correct? So let's continue. So we are substituting this. We are saying x times y which is 32 minus x. You get an idea. Correct? Now you have to just open the bracket. So you get 32x minus x squared or write minus first, factor this out, you get x squared minus 32x. Uh, I'm going for completing the squares and I'm not really factoring it. Do you see that part? Correct? Now what is half of 32? Half of 32, so we'll do on this side. Okay. So the next step is complete squares. So whenever you have maximum or minimum question, that is the preferred method. So let's rewrite. So we have product equals to minus. We have x square minus 32x. Completing squares means take half of this number, which is 16, square it. Add and subtract this number. You get an idea, right? This is what you have to do. The first three numbers will always be a perfect square. That's how it gets its name. So we have x times, let me put a square bracket also, x minus 16 whole square. So that takes care of the three terms and then we have minus 16 square. So let's write down 16 square is how much? 256 with a negative sign. Correct? So it's a good idea to introduce square brackets since, you know, there are already another bracket here. Let's open the bracket now, minus x minus 16 whole square, and that becomes plus 256. Now that is a parabola in vertex form, correct? Minus means opening downwards. Minus means it opens downwards. So it's a parabola kind of like this. And so you see that we do have a maximum here and the coordinates of the vertex are 16, 256. This is find two numbers whose sum is 32. One of the numbers is 16, correct? So we say x equals to 16, y is equal to, now we're going to use this, 32 minus 16, which is also 16. So there could be a question which says two numbers and will give you one answer. So I'm kind of puzzled with this, but that is how it is in the books and the answer is correct. So we'll write down the two numbers are, sorry to write that, okay. The two numbers are, two numbers are, are 16 and 16. <laughs> That's how it is. Okay, thank you.